Thanks for tuning in. I have completed my little adventure traveling north of Chattanooga, Tennessee, up the Tennessee River. I actually was able to take the Tennessee all the way up to the headwaters of the Tennessee. And I was also able to cruise up the Little Tennessee River as far as I could go, as far as any boat could go, really, because they don't have a lock through one of the dams. And through this, I met some wonderful people in um, Knoxville, Tennessee. Um, pe numerous people had mentioned to me, if there's a football game there, you need to go experience a football game and be part of the floating Navy. Well, it's called the Volunteer Navy. And so I did that on August 31st. I went up and uh, joined the group in Knoxville for the Volunteer Navy and experienced all the pregame activities there. It's just amazing to this northerner how, how far and how excited the folks around here get for uh, college football games and all the pageant and everything that goes on before the football games. It was amazing. I have a video of that if you want to take a look at it. Uh, while I was there, I met Carl and Dave. Carl was my guide up the, the Tennessee River all the way up to the headwaters. Really nice guy. And I also met Dave, who um, lives in a town called uh, Talico Village, which is downriver uh, on the Little Tennessee, actually. And he invited me to come stay at his slip for a few days, which I graciously accepted. And he was a fabulous host. Uh, helped me out quite a bit. And during that time at Teleco, I also met Ed and Kathy, who uh, befriended me, and uh, just really nice folks. It was just really enjoyable spending some time there. And as a result, I was able to do several things. I was able to go visit Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg, and that was quite entertaining. I also have videos about that if you want to look at those. And I also had the opportunity to go to Franklin, North Carolina, where I was able to do some gem mining, where I actually dug into the, where what they do is they go to their mine with their, their back front end loader, and they take a couple scoops out of the mine and then put it on, in this covered area, and then you go through the covered area, put them in boxes, and then you go, go through the sluice. And the, there's a whole video on that. It's just a short one. It's only like a minute and 35 seconds, something like that. And so it was a great experience. I'm glad to be able to bring that to a close. I am getting ready to start my next great adventure, which is touring New Zealand and Australia. And I will be making videos on that as well. So thanks for tuning in. May all your seas be calm. Take care.